We urge action now to defend the poor by supporting Uplift Harris. If it's that was Bishop James Dixon, president of the NAACP, showing his support for Uplift Harris. The program is supposed to start providing financial aid for nearly 2,000 low-income families later this month. But as we've reported on for about a week now, the state is asking the court to block that from happening. Stephanie Whitfield joins us live outside the civil courthouse this morning with more on both sides of this story. Stephanie, good morning to you. Good morning. That's right. The state is asking for an injunction to stop Uplift Harris from going into effect, and the judge today could decide to grant or deny that request. Uplift Harris is a Harris County pilot program designed to provide eligible families with a guaranteed income of $500 a month for 18 months to help them get out of poverty. But last week, Texas Attorney General Ken Paxton announced a lawsuit calling that program unconstitutional, unconstitutional and an abuse of public funds. He said taxpayer money can't be, quote, redistributed with no accountability or reasonable expectation of a general benefit. But today, Harris County is pushing back. They're asking the court to allow Uplift Harris to proceed, arguing the program provides social and economic benefit to low-income families and the broader community. Now, a judge is going to be the one to decide the fate of Uplift Harris, but in the meantime, nearly 2,000 families are waiting to see what happens next. Reporting live in downtown Houston, Stephanie Whitfield, KHOU 11 News.